Hello, my name is Preston Zacharias, and it is my pleasure to welcome you all to the 2015 Flex Tech High School commencement ceremony. It is truly an honor to be on this stage representing such a wonderful graduating class. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you my story of how I found success at Flex Tech and why this school is so important to the spirit of public education. Because unfortunately, there aren't many schools like this one. One way that Flex Tech has helped me be successful was through flexible course scheduling. Flex Tech really shines in this area. The staff works hard to craft a schedule that meets both academic and personal needs of all the students. The open-ended and applicable curriculum cultivated by project and individual-based learning means that students get to learn and apply new material in a way that is most comfortable for them. They also get to learn at a pace that is most comfortable to them. Students can do any sort of project that they would like to demonstrate mastery of course topics. For me, being able to move at my own pace and complete courses in my own style were the two main reasons that I chose to come to FlexTech. After 10 years of being bored with the curriculum and trapped inside of it, I felt, I felt that I had had enough. I decided that I wanted to make a transition to something better. I wanted to get ahead by taking extra classes online and through local community colleges. Thankfully for FlexTech, I was able to complete a total of 23 college credits between my junior and senior years. This helped me win a full tuition scholarship to Central Michigan University, as well as placement into their honors college as an incoming freshman. I really love how attentive the FlexTech staff is to our interests and our academic goals. But it's not just in academics that FlexTech stands out. FlexTech High School should also be recognized for their staff's ability to incorporate social and emotional learning into their advisory program. Advisory is a class in which every student at FlexTech is paired with a teacher who will then serve as their advisor. It is their main responsibility to help keep their advisees or their students on track for graduation and keep them motivated to do well. Advisory was especially beneficial for me because it, because it presented me with an opportunity to get very close with one of my teachers. This close bond that students um, develop with their advisor gives them a person that they can talk to about school as well as home life struggles. In advisory, we did several activities to help us figure out what we would like to do after high school. In advisory, we also did career and personality aptitude testing. This helped me decide on what college I would go to and what career I would pursue in the long run. Without the advisory program and my advisor helping me along the way, I would not be as determined nor as prepared for graduation today. My advisor helped me through many difficult times. Some kids simply don't have an adult in their life that, they, that will be there for them to encourage them along their way in high school. But with advisory, every student is guaranteed that one person that they will get to build a relationship with and form trust. I want to share with you an experience that will help demonstrate how compassionate the teachers at FlexTech really are. Last year, my junior year, before the first semester was over, a student began to feel discouraged about their schooling and made plans to drop out of high school. My advisor, who had never talked to the student before, felt heartbroken when she heard of the student's plans. She talked with the student for a long time about how amazing the student was and all the great things that would come from finishing high school. I remember my advisor coming back into the classroom with a somber look on her face. I asked her what was wrong, and before she had the opportunity to tell me, tears began to run down her face. I had never seen a teacher cry up to this point. Many think that it would be uncomfortable, but for me it was actually sort of comforting. Not because my teacher was crying, but because I realized something that day. I realized that there are so many students who are barely scraping by and don't have the home life and motivation that I was fortunate enough to have. I never put much thought into these circumstances because of the way that some teachers had treated the students up to this point. They gave me the impression that they would not amount to much and that they should be discluded or discounted. However, that day I saw the real struggle that some kids face in public education. What I also saw was that there were in fact teachers who cared enough about students like those, that they would weep and beg for them to stay at high school. That day, I realized that I was a part of a school unlike any other. I felt like I was a part of something of the future, and really, I think that I was right. 
I think that as time goes on, society will see the importance for compassionate teachers in charter school settings like this one. And maybe one day, all public schools will in some way or another resemble Flex Tech High. We have arrived at the part of the speech where I give the big round of thank yous. So here it goes. Thank you, audience members. Thank you for attending tonight. Thank you for being here to support your loved ones. A special thank you to my family members and friends for attending tonight, taking the time out of your schedule to travel and support me. Thank you, FlexTech families, for sending your students, your children, to FlexTech to make their lives and the lives around them better. Thank you for realizing the importance of quality education. Thank you, FlexTech students, for attending FlexTech. You helped me make these past two years the best two years of my life. Thank you to the administration and all the board members and all the faculty members as well. You helped make this school successful and thank you for looking out for our safety and well-being. And of course, a huge thanks goes to all the teachers, even the ones I wasn't fortunate enough to have. Thank you for caring. Thank you for being there for students who without you may have never had the desire or determination to graduate and who because of you learned that it is okay to be proud of their work and that it's okay to believe in themselves. Teachers, although students will let you down and give you a hard time, thank you for not giving up on us. Seriously, thank you for being hard on us. I mean it. Thank you for badgering us to get our work done. It shows that you guys care and that you want the best for us. To conclude, let me just wrap up by saying that there are so many good things happening here that it really does make me want to stay forever. However, I know I have to go on and it makes me sad and I leaving today with a heavy heart, having to say goodbye to everyone I've come to know at FlexTech. However, it's not goodbye forever, it's just to see you later, because I know the connections that I have formed here at FlexTech with all the staff members and students will live on with me forever, as, long, as well as the memories that I have made. So again, my name is Preston Zacharias, representing class of 2015 FlexTech High School, and as I leave you, please put your hands together for the school leader, the lady who helped make all this possible, Mrs. Melanie Labor.